In geometry, a point at infinity or ideal point is an idealized limiting point at the end of each line. In the case of an affine plane, there is one ideal point for each pencil of parallel lines of the plane. Adjoining these points produces a projective plane, in which no point can be distinguished, if we forget which points were added. This holds for a geometry over any field, and more generally over any division ring. In the real case, a point at infinity completes a line into a topologically closed curve. In higher dimensions, all the points of infinity form a projective subspace of one dimension less than that of the whole projective space to which they belong. A point at infinity can also be added to the complex line, thereby turning it into a closed surface known as the complex projective line, CP1, also called the Riemann sphere. In the case of a hyperbolic space, each line has two distinct ideal points. Here, the set of ideal points takes the form of a quadric. Affine geometry In an affine or Euclidean space of higher dimension, the points of infinity are the points which are added to the space to get the projective completion. The set of the points of infinity is called, depending on the dimension of the space, the line at infinity the plane at infinity or the hyperplane at infinity, in all cases a projective space of one less dimension. As a projective space over a field is a smooth algebraic variety, the same is true for the set of points at infinity. Similarly, if the ground field is the real or the complex field, the set of points at infinity is a manifold. Perspective in artistic drawing and technical perspective, the projection on the picture plane of the point at infinity of a class of parallel lines is called the vanishing point. Hyperbolic geometry In hyperbolic geometry, points of infinity are most times named ideal points other than in other geometries each line has two points at infinity. Given a line L and a point P not on L, the right and left limiting parallels converge asymptotically to different points at infinity. All points of infinity together form the Cayley absolute or boundary of a hyperbolic plane. Other generalizations. This construction can be generalized to topological spaces. Different compactifications may exist for a given space, but arbitrary topological space admits Alexandrov extension, also called the one-point compactification when the original space is not itself compact. Projective line is the Alexandrov extension of the corresponding field, thus the circle is the one-point compactification of the real line, and the sphere is the one-point compactification of the plane. Projective spaces Pn for n greater than 1 are not one-point compactifications of corresponding affine spaces for the reason mentioned above, and completions of hyperbolic spaces with omega points are also not one-point compactifications.